name out there for the Patriots, and that's Dante Hightower. What are you hearing there? Well, Dante Hightower is a guy that the Patriots would love to have back, but they would love to have him back at their number, and that number was not as high as the franchise tag. A little bit of a surprise, maybe they didn't even uh, explore the possibility of giving him the transition tag, which would have given him the right of first refusal on that one, but... They let him go out there. They're letting him explore the market, and they would love to have him back. But right now, the question is, what kind of market is he going to be able to find out there? And what the Patriots are doing is what they've done in recent years, which is we can afford to pay a little bit less than some other teams. And they've made it clear to some of their free agents, and my, I gather that uh, uh, Hightower is one of them, that there's a discount if you want to stay with the Patriots. A little bit of a premium uh, other teams have to pay because a lot of guys have taken a little bit less to stay here and play with the Patriots. In the meantime, Hightower is out there looking for the best possible deal that he can find. So this one bears watching over the next couple of days. And the fact that the Patriots said goodbye to Chandler Jones and Jamie Collins but held on to Dante Hightower certainly speaks to how important they believe that he is. He certainly was important in the Super Bowl with that sack fumble. They would not have won the game without that one there. So their we last, will see if he yeah. winds up coming back at their price. Their last two Super Bowl wins, going back to the tackle on Marshawn Lynch uh, at the goal line back in Super yeah. Bowl uh, 49.